Hey everyone, welcome to my new tutorial. In this tutorial, I am gonna show how to make this animation with Element 3D and After Effects. Let's get started. So first step, let's create new solid and add solid Element 3D. Click OK and go to FX, Video Copilot and Element. Then back to project and select this texture texture from freepick.com I will add the online link and project files select this texture move the inside this box composition and hide this image then select this element to read the solid go to FX control and open custom layers again custom texture maps layer 1 select this texture ok let's close custom layers and go to scene setup and let's create new box ok and select this box open material select this material and diffuse let's click non set and select custom layer 1 texture ok let's click ok then again click non set for glossiness and select this custom texture click ok and change 100 to 41 ok then again reflect it click non set select this texture click ok and normal bump click non set select again this texture click ok and change 20 ok then let's open this color and change red click ok and change diffuse 4 ok and change environment multiplayer 230 ok and reflect change color red click ok and change in test 34 or 40 ok So not bad. Let's open this glossiness and change colors. Click OK and reflect it. Change again like this. Click OK. OK, nice. Then go to presets environment and version 1 environment and select this studio warm blue red ok then select this box model and ctrl d for duplicate move to left and move to right again ctrl d move to left and like this and select this box models hold shift ok ctrl D and move to right and left ok ctrl D again nice ok and hold ctrl select this model move to right and hold control select this move to the right and this okay and again hold control select this model this box model control D for duplicate and move to up change scale okay and move to down 
Okay, control D again for duplicate. Move to here. Again, control D. So this is random boxes. You can make how to like it. Again, control D. Move to up. Okay, nice. Hold control, select this model. Move to left. And select this box model. Again, control D. Move to up. And change scale. Okay. Then select this box model, change name, main box, click OK. And change aux channel, channel 2. Click OK. Then right mouse, new and new camera. Press it like this and click OK. For control camera, press C like this. And let's select first pause. Okay. <clears throat> then select camera, open options, camera options, and click depot field off to on. Hold shift and change deep. Let's change quality quarter and change deep. Okay. So let's select this element 3D back to scene setup. And open default model. Use diffuse color and change intensity like this. Okay, nice. Click OK. Again, go to Scene Setup. Select this box. Move to here. And hold Control Select this model. Move to here. And select this box model. Control D. Move to here. Again, Control D. Move to here. Move to up, okay. And click OK. And let's move to back. Okay. Again, go to scene setup. Select this mini box, main box, and change scale. Okay. And move to down. Click OK. Let's zoom object. Okay. Change focus distance. Nice. And aperture. 50 or 20 okay select this element 3d go to one group and aux channel open aux channel 2 and rotation change rotations one and this one and this one and change this 4 to 5 okay make new chain frames go to 10 seconds, change, 0. Okay, let's see. Okay, nice, not bad. Let's change minus 1 and this and this. Okay, nice. Change aperture 30. And select this element 3D solid. Open render settings. 
and ambient occlusion click enable and change intensity 10 or 6 okay and open lighting change red or cinema okay and of a physical environment change exports like this okay let's go to effects presets and search effect lumetri lumetri color let's use for this element 3d and open basic correction change exports okay let's see okay not bad select this element 3d ctrl d for duplicate and select this lumetri color let's delete go to fx preset and search effect glow select this styles glow let's use for this and change name solid glow and glow radius Okay, let's change glow radius 100. And glow change this 80. Okay, then select this glow, change normal to add. Or screen or overlay okay nice and select this glow press t open opacity change 4 to 5 or 20 okay not bad then let's use lumetri color for this glow open basic correction and change export one or three okay Okay, not bad. I like it. Let's select this glow. Go to Element 3D. Open Scene Setup. And select this material. Change Environment Multipliers. 300. Or 400. Click OK. Okay, nice. Select this element 3D and go to lighting and open additional lighting. Change 200. Let's see. Okay. Let's see full. Okay, nice. So thank you for watching my tutorial and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.